Hello. This video was created by Jane Ofino Ganova, an information developer at BMC Software, and narrated by a computer generated voice. In this video, I will show you how administrators can prepare the room assets for reservation, and how they can enable the option for reserving room assets in BMC Digital Workplace. This feature is useful when employees need to reserve room assets, such as conference rooms, guest rooms, massage rooms, and similar facilities that are offered at an office location. Before you start preparing the room assets reservation for your company's employees, make sure that the following initial requirements are fulfilled. Your company mailbox server is configured by a system administrator. Available room assets, for example, conference halls, are created, configured, and added to the floor maps in BMC Digital Workplace and the Exchange Pluggable Provider is enabled in the Admin Console. Now you can start preparing your assets for reservations. In BMC Digital Workplace Admin Console, go to Location Management. Select View All under the Assets menu. Here you can search for an asset by location. We will select the KF Office as an example. As you can see, the list of available assets is loaded. Now you can select a particular asset, and prepare this asset for reservations. We will select Conference Hall 6. First specify the email address that was provided to you by your system administrator. This will enable a reservation on the Microsoft Exchange server. Then modify other custom fields as required, to provide more information about the room for your employees. After you fill in the fields, click Save Asset. The asset is updated successfully. Now I will show you, how to enable the Reservations option, for the whole asset type. Go to Location Management. Then select Types Library under the Assets menu. You should perform the next steps for each asset type, that you want to enable for reservations. We will select the conference room type as an example. Here select the allow reservations, and allow check-in checkboxes, and then save the changes. As you can see, the asset type is updated successfully. Now as we have prepared the room assets for reservation, and enabled the reservation option, the end users can reserve these rooms on their locations page. They can click Make a Reservation, then find the required location and asset, and then reserve this asset for a certain date and period of time. This was a quick guide about enabling room reservations. Thank you for watching.